Facebook is really trying to help people in the real estate profession. They actually came out with a trends and insights report to better utilize their platform. If you're brand new to me, my name is Monty Weaver, digital strategist, and my goal is to help real estate professionals get more leads and more business, more exposure using digital strategies. And in this video, I want to go through the trends and insights report that Facebook actually distributed. Now, if you want to actually get this report for yourself, you can click on the link below and you'll be able to download this report directly to your Facebook Messenger. So without further ado, let's look at the Trends and Insights report that Facebook has actually provided for us. Now before I actually dive into it, I want you to keep in mind throughout this whole video that this is Facebook's report. So sometimes it might be a little biased for Facebook but really it's to let you know how to best utilize their platform. And this was made strictly for real estate professionals. So if you have not seen this report, you really have to pay attention to what's going on in the digital landscape, primarily in this case with Facebook. And so we're gonna go through some of the points on the report. And I want you to pay attention to the ongoing theme throughout this entire report. There's a key feature that you really want to utilize if you're not already to really get the best results. So let's dive into this report. Now, this is a 40 page report. We're not gonna go through all 40 pages. You can download it uh, in the description below, get it directly in your Facebook Messenger and you can read the entire report. Let's start with the first section, Consumer Trends. This section is really letting us know that we really have to tailor our content for mobile. Mobile is where our consumer lives and we definitely need to make sure that everything we do is mobile optimized and mobile friendly. Whether that's posting a video, whether that's posting a picture, whether that's posting text, Facebook ads, we really want to keep in mind that people are on mobile. So that means everything that you do has to be quick and responsive because people have limited attention spans, especially when they're just scrolling through. So we have to make a lasting impact in a very short amount of time. And by focusing on where the customers actually are in the digital landscape, their mobile devices, we definitely wanna make sure we optimize to talk directly to our consumers on their device. This section says people hold the power. So this is essential when understanding how people are gonna be able to find you and find that new home or to get that great deal that you have to offer them. Now on this page, it talks about the three ways that we can really make an impact when it comes to using Facebook. Mobile video. So if you're scared to get behind the camera, get unscared really, really quick because if you're able to use video, you're able to reach an audience that's gonna pay more attention to you and get better recognition in the Facebook algorithm, thus getting more exposure, which is what you really want. Messaging, being able to talk directly to specific people using the Messenger app. So if you haven't downloaded Facebook Messenger, make sure you download Facebook Messenger on your mobile platform because not only can you talk one to one, but you can also talk one to many. And we'll talk about that on another video when we talk about Messenger marketing. And then Facebook marketing partners team up with a digital expert to get your listing seen. That's almost what you're doing now. You're teaming up with me, a digital person online, teaching you how to use Facebook and use it better for your business. Now you can always outsource additional tasks when it comes to digital to save you time, whether that's posting on social media or running Facebook or digital ad campaigns to get more listings. But being able to work with someone and learn from someone that's in the digital space is something that Facebook is highly encouraging that you do. Section two of this report actually talks about video. Now, if you haven't caught on already, video is going to be the reoccurring theme throughout this entire report. They want you to focus on video. Why? Because video allows people to stay on their platform much longer. How many times have you gone down that rabbit hole of watching one video that leads to the next video that leads to the next video? And next thing you know, you spent a long time watching videos that you didn't initially plan to. So using video is what the Facebook platform encourages that you do. And as a real estate professional and this report telling you that that's what they're encouraging you to do, 
definitely pay attention and keep in mind that this is going to allow you to get better results on Facebook. This section quickly talks about the importance of using video ads. Now, if you're not running Facebook ads, I highly encourage you to get on the Facebook ad bandwagon and start pumping out those ads. For as little as $5 a day, you can reach hundreds of people in your local area, being able to become the local celebrity, being able to become the person that people know who to purchase a home from, who to get a loan from, or who to actually have their house built by. Using video allows you to really give a behind the scenes tour of what's going on in real life. By being able to show a home and actually being able to visually see it ahead of time, by being able to see what's around it, by being able to see the street and the neighborhood. As we continue to scroll down and check out the next few pages, you see that mobile video is highlighted on many of these pages. This report talks about the correct dimension sizes that you want to use and focus on, different tools to actually create your videos, why video is so important. Those different video layouts, where the video is positioned within the Facebook platform. Telling a story through video and using the video carousel. Now one of the areas that you will have a competitive advantage in is if you're able to use the new offering by Facebook called Showcase. This is going to really be able to allow you to put on some premium level content and those premium level contents get more attention. They get more eyes and more visibility. So definitely check that out as an additional way to do video. And when it comes to actually placing your video, keep in mind that you can place video on your profile, on your business page, and even inside of your Facebook group. So putting together a local group, a local community group on Facebook, putting videos in that group will allow you to continue to grow your brand and build authority. Now let's jump into text messaging. So like I mentioned, you can use Messenger to build this rapport with your potential client interacting with them, asking them the vital questions that you need to know to make sure you get them in the best position possible. And whether you do this manually or automated, this is the best feature that you can use when communicating with people online using the Facebook platform. Again, the longer you keep people on the platform, the more Facebook encourages that your post gets seen and you become visible. So using all the features in the platform is something that you really wanna focus on going into 2020. The next part of this report talks about teaming up with a marketing partner. Now this is someone that you can find online or in your local area that can really help you maximize the platform. You know, sometimes we just don't have enough time in the day to create that great engaging post, something that will really trigger the Facebook algorithm to get more people to see it. Sometimes we just don't have the time to create a Facebook ad, or maybe you've run ads and they just haven't worked for you. You want to work with someone that does this on a regular basis and someone that's probably even doing this for multiple clients because this is what they focus on. Now this report goes into a lot of information, a lot of statistics, a lot of best practices, and it gives you some results of how people have successfully used the Facebook platform for their real estate business. So definitely download this report and read through it and check it out and make sure you start to implement some of these strategies to get better results, get more leads, and really dominate on the Facebook platform and become a known expert in the real estate profession. My name is Monty Weaver. I hope you got some tremendous value from this video. Make sure you hit the subscribe button, turn on the notifications, and I'll see you on the next video.